The weather is just one of the concerns for New Year's Eve. Another drunk drivers. Tonight, some officers are doing their holiday patrol on foot. Mary Jo Ola joining us live from South Milwaukee, where she just wrapped up a walk along with law enforcement. How did it go, Mary Jo? Pretty smoothly, Shannon, you know, hours before we ring in 2019 here, the South Milwaukee police officers hit the streets here downtown to check on people, making sure that they're celebrating safely and, like you said, to deter any drunk driving. You guys got your rides home tonight or walking? Oh, yeah. All right. On the last day of 2018, South Milwaukee police officers Rob Wentz and David Hepner are meeting people face to face at local bars. Being that the bars really don't have to close on New Year's Eve, New Year's Day, you kind of don't know what to expect. We actually like it when they do walkthroughs. It just makes everybody feel safe in case there's any. Sometimes you can have trouble on a New Year's Eve because you get people that don't normally go out and aren't used to drinking a lot. Wentz and Hepner walk from bar to bar chatting, but also keeping a close eye on people celebrating. We're making sure that there aren't any minors in the bar and just we're making sure that people aren't getting over served. And it's the nice thing about being in there and people seeing us is maybe it makes that person take a second thought about driving home. They say it's a nice change compared to patrolling from their cars. How are you guys doing? You can see more things going on. Obviously, you're slower. You meet with people more often, seeing if there's any any problems or any problems that somebody might have. They can come up to you as opposed to maybe try to waving you down as you're passing by in the car. The nice part about being out on foot is you actually get to talk to members of the community. Now, over the last two decades, officers Hepner and Wentz say they've noticed more people taking advantage of sober rides home. They say it's a trend they hope continues. Reporting live in South Milwaukee, Mary Joola, today's TMJ4.